I bought a new set of dumbbells. These are really cool. These are called power blocks. They allow you to replace 28 sets of dumbbells. Not 28 dumbbells, 28 sets, which is over 50 dumbbells or 56 dumbbells. This will allow you to replace. So rather than having dumbbells all over the place, you have two dumbbells that allow you to adjust each one of those increments. Now one of the disadvantages of power blocks off the bat is you only have one user that can use them at a time. So I can only use these and I can readjust my weights for different uh, you know, denominations that I want, but only one person can use them as opposed to if I had you know, 28 sets of dumbbells, you know, 28 people could actually use those at the same time. So if you don't have a lot of people that you know, use the dumbbells at the same time, then one pair of power blocks to me are superior. So let's start off with the handle. This handle weighs five pounds. Each one of these blocks weighs 10. So here's, here's one block, the white and the black are two blocks there. So each one of those blocks are 10 pound increments. So if I've got five pounds here and each one of those are 10, so now I can adjust my increments from five to 15, 25, 35, 45, all the way up to 85, because this is a 90 pound block right here. Each one of these are 90 pounds. But it also has what's called adder weights. So each one of these are two and a half pounds. So if I add the two pounds of weights here, now this is a 10 pound dumbbell. Now when I drop it inside, it's 10 pounds and each one is additional 10 pounds. So each one of these weights are color coded. So you know, we've got white all the way through the, the uh, purple color and each one of 10 is 10 pounds. And on top here is a label which tells me exactly what the value of each one of those is. So if I've got my adder weights inside here, then the white is 30, then you got 40, 50, 60, and going all the way up to 90. So if I want to select, you know, a certain weight, you just go in here, oops, pop it in. And this is a magnet, they, they kind of, they come in, they, they, they kind of really are magnetized so that this doesn't fall out. Very secure set. And that's where the, what the label looks like. And let me close this. I'll show you the handle. So that's the handle. And it shows you this is what the values are. Without adder weights, it's 15 all the way up through 85. And if I put the two adder weights in here, it's 20 pounds up through 90 pounds. So that's how that works. So that's how they adjust. So if I want to use, if I've got two adder weights here, if I want to use 30 pounds, that's the white. So I pop it in here. And here, that's my 30 pound. If I want to go to 60 pounds, that's the yellow. Bring it right there, pop them in. Now I've got 60 pounds. So you basically see how it goes. So each time I make a selection, it's a different uh, weight. So the orange, that one is 40 pounds. So that's how I adjust. Now if I want to go, you know, cause these are 10 pound increments. And the reason I, I go 10 pound increments is because my, my handle is 10 pounds. So if I want to go to 35 pounds, I have to come over here, take my add weights, let's see, get to my open position. That's an open and a closed position. I drop those add weights in there. Now at five pound increments, so if I want to go to 35 pounds, then I will go to the green, I mean the orange, there's 35, 35 pounds. Did I go to 45, 55, 65? So a little bit of changing. If you're gonna change, you know, in, in small increments, you know, you kind of have to switch. If you have a five-pound increment, you have to, you know, it doesn't take very long to change it. Just pop that out. Take your adder weights, pop them in, and you're ready for your next set. So it only takes a couple seconds. Now you're ready for, you know, whatever your next set is. These are they come in different types. They have what's called Elite, which are metal. These has a urethane coating. These are what's called a professional. This is top of the line. Elite, or you see that if you see dumbbells like this, they're basically square like a block. These kind of are rounded here. So this is a called the, the uh, Pro. The sport model is round, just like this, but it, all metal. And so you have the Elite, Sport, and then the Pro. And that's how they work. And to me, you can't beat power blocks. I use them all the time. 
In fact, I had another set of power blocks and they were going up to 60 pounds, but, and they were fine, but over the, then this year, I've been lifting heavier and 60 pounds wasn't doing it. I needed more weight. Can you imagine that? That's, that's called old man strong. So I needed more weight. So I, I'm up to 90 pounds now. So the 60s lasted me up until my 60s. So the 90s will last me into my 90s, hopefully. And if I had to get past that, then I'll, I'll upgrade from there. But these are really awesome dumbbells, power blocks. They cost about, new, This these cost about 800 bucks new. You could buy them used. I think I got these for like 400. You know, people buy them, they get rid of them, and uh, you know, you're able to get a great deal. Usually, if you want 50 pounds, used to, the average is about 50 pound blocks. They come in 50 pounds, 70 pounds, 90 pounds, then 125, and I think you go up to 175. Those are huge, but you can, it, it gets really heavy. But the 50 pound blocks, probably about 300 new, 300, 350, you get those for probably 200 used. And then um, you can just go from there. So that's my little review on the power blocks. They are awesome. And uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to just doing more workouts with them. All right, guys, that's it. Power blocks, get you some. See ya, bye.